YouTube, it's sunshine. I just wanted to go ahead and give you just a really quick like day one review of this hair I have installed. Um, it is the Naked Nature. Hold on, it's because <laughs> it's a long name, it's a handful. It's the Naked Nature Brazilian Virgin Remy hair in deep wave. Yes, deep wave. Um, it, you know, I took it out of the box, what was it, Saturday, I got it Saturday, and, um, you know, for the most part it was straight, um, as you can see it's gotten a little wave to it, I haven't put any product in, in it, I haven't put any water in it or anything like that, but I live in Florida, so I can walk out the door, the humidity is going to cause this to curl up, so I'm actually not planning on applying any type of moisture or water to it, and I'm just going to see how long it takes till it gets to its real, you know, wave that's supposed to get to. I installed this yesterday as a sew-in. Um, my most difficult thing about doing a sew-in with my hair is because of the fact that I have my, my sides shaved. So my sides are cut. Um, I have like a little undercut thing going on and in the back it's kind of going on. I don't know if you can see that, but yeah. Um, but that's my most difficult thing because this is a seven piece, um, this is seven pieces of hair. I have it in the long one so I have the 18 inch, 20 inch, 22 inch, and it comes with a closure. I think I want to say it's a 16 inch closure. I can't, I can't remember, but I didn't install the closure because of the fact that I wanted to have a lot of volume. In order for me to accomplish that, I need to make sure that I can put every single piece of um, the six other pieces in my head. I actually ended up, I think, having about almost half of the 18 inch um, left over, so I have the 22 at the bottom then 20 then 18 at the top so you know got a little layer thing this is how um low it hangs in its straight form so it's like right here um on me and i for the most part like it it's very soft it's very flowy um it hasn't shed much like i'm expecting some shedding you know you know a couple of pieces here and there so it's not that bad little bit of tangle not too much just you know granted I sleep on my hair I don't wrap it up I probably should but I don't so I'm gonna get some tangles when I you know sleep on it and everything I'm not using a silk um a silk pillowcase so you know it happens just comb through it I haven't had any problems with it or anything like that granted this is only day two well sorry technically day one um because I sewed it in yesterday and the way I did it is I got a I did a perimeter braid all the way around and then got a little bit of leave out left just a scotch to kind of cover over the front and um, I just sewed them in as close right next to each other as possible back forth back forth back forth um, I kind of got worried that I wasn't gonna have enough space so I kind of got a little bit of space right here and then I had about an inch um, of space left up here where I did the um, what is it the flip over method by Ivy so I started from this end went back forth back forth back forth back forth all the way across so I can flip it over this way um let's see here you can't really see you know too much so I guess I hit it pretty well at least I'm happy about with it being hidden as much as it is granted yeah this is seen but that's because it's gonna lay down anyway so somebody's looking at my head that quick that much like y'all need to get out of my head the only person supposed to be looking at my hair that deeply is my boyfriend and he knows better he's white he doesn't even pull my hair we're not even gonna go there <laughs> but um so yeah I, I do like the hair as of now it's really good this is a freaking investment man I paid two hundred dollars two hundred and thirty five dollars for this hair damn near took a personal loan out to pay for it um <laughs> but I, I like it for the most part we'll see I really hope because I'm gonna be really pissed if I have this hair and then a month later, you know, it decides that it wants to crap out on me, I will be furious. Especially when I looked online and I could have bought this package online for like 150 or something like that I saw um, online for the same exact packaging. So we'll see. Um, I do have some of the 18 left so what I'm going to do is use that as a tester and I'm going to lift the color. And I'm going to do a ombre type of color deal with it. So with that, I think I have my color in here. Yeah, so 
way back I bought some um, color from Sally's and so I have the Clairol Brilliance in Magenta and in Cayenne or Cyan and so what I'm going to do is try to do a little bit of this with the hair in ombre format so I'll have the blue at the very top blending down into the magenta and the middle part will be a little purple so we'll see how that works and then I'll reverse it maybe do some magenta at the top and then blend down to the blue and see if it works if it does and the hair still has a really good texture and everything I'll show you guys how I do that um, in an another video I'll probably link it to this one later um, I'll see how that works out and how the quality of hair is after I've lifted the color and applied a um, new color on it because it does say on here you can dye bleach and perm the hair so hopefully it's gonna come out right I actually bought what was it the Indian rain hair two years ago it lasted for a year and then I decided oh let me just throw some color because I wanted light brown yeah that hair was just like hell no we won't go and that that hair was wrecked after that later on I just um, I was talking to somebody and they were like yeah you can't do that to the Indian rain hair so wish I would have known but you know it is what it is it lasted a year that hair was about a hundred dollars so it was the the I got my year's worth of investment basically it lasted a year that's um what was it it's like less than 10 bucks a day so you know whatever um so hopefully I'm going for two years on this hair so fingers crossed on that um, I actually looked online and saw another hair by the same company, just a different wave pattern. It is the Loose Curl. And I don't know if you can see it. I'll see if I can show it to you on here. But it's the Loose Curl right here. I really want to get that. <clears throat> I really would like to get that pack um, and try it in the 22-24. And see if Naked Nature actually has individual bundles because I want a 24-26 as well. I love the long hair and I love it long and curly so I'm gonna see if I can get that to happen but other than that um, the hair as of now love it it's really nice it's really flowy it's very beautiful and bouncy you know I shake my hair and it moves with me um, so I hope that I get to keep it <laughs> for a long time I'm gonna do my best to I saw somebody use um, the coconut milk um, leave-in conditioner so I'm actually gonna get some of that and use on it after it gets its curl it goes to its curly form via humidity not via me doing it so I'll take some pictures and everything to show you kind of daily how it does its little you know curl up and stuff like that and see how good it does because I'm not in a hurry for it to get curly when it does it will and that will be awesome um can't think of anything else so I'm not gonna you know go any longer with this hair and please excuse the humming noise unfortunately my bathroom has a fan and it doesn't cut off until the lights cut off and I don't want to be doing this video in the dark um let's see here um if you guys have any questions about the hair and everything feel free to hit me down below and i'll be more than happy to um reply and i will definitely be getting into um lifting that other piece that i have and kind of testing it and showing you guys what happens with it um within the next week or so so you'll see that video coming up shortly so other than that thank you guys so much for your time you have a wonderful wonderful day youtube i love you peace and hair grease i'm out